First, I want to wish each and every one a very, very happy new year. I hope that 2023 brings each and every one of you everything that your heart desires, but most important, health. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Grace. In this video, I am going to share with you a sneak peek of upcoming videos for the new year. Hobby Lobby is having this huge sale. You know, 75% off was an absolutely amazing deal. I purchased this metal uh, gift box. I love it. It really all comes out. So it is metal and it's a perfect size to put under a tree or on a step. But I'm not going to be leaving this like this. I'm going to be doing a project with it. So stay tuned for that. I went and I picked up this table today. I thought it was just so unique. It does have some um, spots up here. It's so interesting. It was that it's an egg. It's an egg table. I'm going to call it my egg table. I can't wait to see what I'm going to do with it. This will be in an upcoming video. If you have any suggestions, please leave me in the comments below. I would love to hear your ideas. I just found it unique and I had to have it. And you know what? For 20 bucks, it was all worth it. Picked up this electrical fireplace. It comes with the electric fireplace over there. And what I liked about it, it just wasn't just a square mantle it had some detail here it was rounded and i love the little um accent going down there you know if i'm going to do an ins inspired piece fireplace piece it needs to be something with a lot of detail and this one had it all i bought these side tables they were 30 dollars for two i like the design on the legs it was an excellent condition i have sanded them or i should say hubby sanded them for me work on this project today we've already taken of course the hardware out and we're going to start this baby I got these uh, rollers at the dollar store and they were $1.50 for two. And now I've added a little bit of uh, water in here because it was extremely thick and I want something a little bit lighter. And I'm gonna show you the consistency. Uh, now I've already wiped all this down. So I didn't want that really, really dark. I wanted a nice light brown. I have this fusion mineral paint and it's called soapstone. It's a beautiful uh, gray and these are $27. Chocolate, Gator Hide. Now, Gator Hide is uh, awesome. Like it's, you can seal everything with it and it's good for outside. That's how good it is. You know, you have to stir well, but there's no sheen or anything. Another one of uh, Clear Coat Flat some of these beautiful colors. These are samples they have. You still have to buy it. It's still $5.99, but these are great if you need it just for a little bit of artwork. I got here, my bill this time was $248. So it is expensive, not cheap. So when you see somebody who is selling a piece of furniture, hey, you know what? It costs them a lot of money to get it done. So plus their time and everything. Now I wanted to show you this. I don't know how I got some of the lighter color on here. I don't know how I must have set it on the table upside down and had a drop or something. So what I did was I sanded it and with, with one of these, just extremely light and it was just, just a little light. Now we're gonna do it again. We're gonna give it another coat to make sure it's all even. You can't tell it's painted at all. I'm using that dollar store roller again. Now, just remember that once you apply the paint, make sure to go with your roller just one last time 
each way so that it leaves no streaks. And this will give you that absolutely perfect finish uh, without any streaks whatsoever. So I'm gonna go back with a buttercream to give it one more coat. If you're looking for a light coat of something more in the cream family, this one is beautiful. And it looks so nice with that chocolate brown. But this is a chalk paint, that's the difference, where the chocolate one that I did is in the mineral pink family. That's okay, I'm not afraid to mix, it's fine. Once you seal it, it's okay. There is some pieces that, or some areas that you can still see through a little bit. I'm not worried, because then I can just go back and just do those pieces. Okay, I wanted to show you that, um, you know, we fixed it. There's absolutely nothing. And I love the way it's turning out. It doesn't even look like it's painted, guys. This is something I would love for you to try. Now I'm gonna be applying the clear coat flat. I'm gonna put three layers. The first layer is gonna be very light. The second layer I'll apply it an hour after. The third layer an hour, an hour after that. Uh, it completely dries and becomes waterproof uh, between 21 and 30 days. So it's an excellent product. You know, when I get subscribers, it encourages me to sort of continue what I'm doing. If this is the type of content that you enjoy watching, I ask that you consider subscribing to my channel. It would mean so much. Thank you. So this is where I've put these tables for now. I love the contrast of the cream and the the dark brown on top, the chocolate. I'm thinking of uh, doing this brown here on this couch, doing it like that. Not sure yet, but if I do, I'll definitely put it on a video. I had this piece I did here. I really like it. Um, it's sort of, I, it has a bay window, so I think it fits perfectly in there. And I did this uh, lamp, which I also have a video on. Uh, that's not a Mackenzie Child's uh, pillow, of course. That's just a buffalo check. I do have the uh, Mackenzie Child's uh, ottoman here, which I really like with my chair. This is sort of where I, my chill, my chill spot. And I have the Mackenzie Child's, um, is that a daisy or daisy rug? Yeah, got that. But yeah, so that's my little space, my little quiet time, and I love it. For now, take care of each other, be kind. Always remember you wanna reach a point in your life when you say remember when, and never ever, I wish I did. We'll see you next time.